I think I've fallen for you And I don't know why I don't know why You love that Sahara In mid-July Mid-July My last name fits you better When I'm with you there's no pressure Miss your worn out sweaters Weather couldn't compromise I love I spent too much time on us And I think you got me stuck on love Hi guys, happy Monday This week I am trying to do a bit of a weekly reset uh, As you will have seen I've made my coffee so far I've done my laundry uh, I've put away some clothes And now I am just transcribing Our shopping list for the week Um I also just dropped my camera for the first time. I've actually never dropped it before and it made this really awful sound. So I'm not sure uh, what the quality is going to be like of the video after this. Um, I think that it probably was probably the autofocus that had a problem. Uh, but basically I've got my shopping list and my meals that we're having this week here. I'm going to go ahead and write them down on a piece of paper to take with me to the supermarket. Um, yeah, so that's basically it so far this morning and I will keep you updated with what else I get up. You can function, I gotta tell you all my secrets And you know that just ain't easy for me as you can see, I have just finished the shopping. I also bought a whole lot of other stuff that didn't need, but this is just what's on the bench. In March, I am filming this like long, uh, this long haul video where I'm going to do uh, my, I'm going to show you my budget and what I spend uh, or what we spend living in Canberra as a couple in a month. So I just got back from shopping a little while ago. I've had a shower, I've washed my hair, I've uh, put away all the groceries uh, and the laundry. And now I'm just going to tidy up a bit more and make the bed. Honestly, this content is not particularly exciting today, um, but I'm just doing like a big reset and cleaning the house and making myself feel better kind of day. Um, so that's what I'm doing. I showed you my shopping before and that was because this month I'm actually doing something quite exciting and that is like a overall budget um, sort of video. I don't know what uh, what I'm going to call it but basically I'm going through all of my expenses uh, for the month of March and I'm tracking everything uh, including how much we spend in each particular area of everything uh, and I'll give you a figure at the end of the month on how much we spent um, on, on how much we spent living here in Canberra. I'm going to take you through my menu for this week as well. Basically we're cooking 10 different meals. Uh, some of them we'll eat for dinner, some of them we'll eat for lunch. So today I'm actually going to be cooking with you a zucchini slice. This is something that's super nostalgic to me because my mum used to always make it when we were kids and also we often used to have it at like Christmas and stuff with my family for some reason. It was just one of the things that was cooked. Um, and as a side to that, we also have a potato and chickpea brothy soup that I've cooked. Uh, tomorrow we'll be having uh, the zucchini slice leftovers and tomato soup. Um, the next day I've made, next day I'm making a salad. Uh, it will have like feta and uh, like some coleslaw and other stuff in it. And in Lewis's, I usually put a can of tofu, no, not a can of tofu, a can of tuna. Um, tomato soup on the side, uh, then I'm also doing a cabbage stir fry the next night because that's um, quite a low carb option. On Friday I'm making another ghost cheese salad and chicken soup for Lewis. On Saturday I'm making such sugar eggs which um, I make in a semi-traditional way to Spain. They don't have such sugar eggs in Spain but they do have this thing called pisto and that's what I make as a base and then I just crack the eggs into it because I can't be bothered to fry them in a different pan basically. Um, and the chicken soup and then on Sunday I'm making like a creamy Brussels sprouts. So yeah, I hope you enjoy me showing you these different meals. And yeah, I will talk to you again soon. Staring out the window, reaching for a North Star, waiting just to wake up from this nightmare where you could be right back in my arms, dancing to the limbo, stuck here in the middle. You tell me that it's simple, but I could paint a thousand different pictures. Because
finished cooking my delicious zucchini side which you would have just seen the recipe for um, on this side I've got a bit of bacon for the rest and I've got tomato on the top for the rest Tuesday so you would have seen today I did some cooking I made like a chicken noodle soup um haven't had that yet but it's been quite nice uh today Lewis and I have just had like a cozy day basic Lewis has played his guitar I've been watching some YouTube and we're just doing like a self-care day more or less um yeah that's basically it for me today at seven I have a class but I'm not sure how I will feel for that so this week has been a very anxious week and I know that I, like I said, I spoke about it last week uh, in my video, but like I know I'm in no position compared to other people to be complaining, but I just feel so much for the people who are in, in a terrible position right now, whether that be the floods in New South Wales uh, or with uh, the war in Ukraine. I don't know, I'm just feeling very, like, uh, it's taking a toll on me emotionally. Um, anyway, yeah, so that's basically the update for this week. For today, I mean, not this week. Why did I say this week? As you can see, I'm not in like a super... Hey guys, so I am in my first Zoom tutorial of the week. Um, I am doing a class called Euro 104 just because it was one of the few classes I had left for uh, that were like open to my majors. Um, so yeah, join me and go to my class. You're all doing doing well and 